Greetings, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be covering the fourth installment in the Matrix franchise, The Matrix Resurrections, released in 2021 and directed by Lana Wachowski, starring Keanu Reeves, Yahya Abdul-Mateen and Carrie Ann Moss. Let's begin. Thomas Anderson is the creator of a video game series called The Matrix, based on his faint memories as Neo. At a coffee shop, he keeps crossing paths with Tiffany, a married mother with no recollection of her past, on which Anderson based the game character, Trinity. He struggles to separate perceived reality from dreams. His therapist prescribes him blue pills to su suppress the occurrences, which he stops taking. Anderson creates a simulation to develop video game characters. A young woman named Bugs learns the simulation is running old code in a loop, enacting the moment when Trinity first found Neo within the Matrix. Bugs discovers a program embodying Morpheus and helps free him. Having deduced that Neo is alive, Bugs and Morpheus extract him from the Matrix. Meanwhile, Anderson's business partner, Smith, regains his memories as Agent Smith, Neo's former nemesis. Neo awakens in a pod and notices Trinity confined in another one nearby before being extracted to Bugs' hovercraft Nemesine. Neo is brought to the human city Io, where he reunites with an elderly Niobe. She explains that 60 years have passed in the real world since the machine war ended and that Neo's allies have died over time, including the original Morpheus. The peace achieved by Neo's sacrifice lasted for many years, but the large number of humans leaving the Matrix created a serious power shortage, causing the machines to fight over limited resources. Zion was destroyed, though most of its people relocated to Io with the aid of sympathetic machines. She says she won't risk Io to help him free Trinity and has him locked in his quarters. Bugs and her crewmates free Neo and enter the Matrix to contact Trinity, where they are intercepted by Smith and other exile programs, including the Merovingian. They attack, but Neo and the Nemosin crew defeat them as Neo's abilities return. They leave and relocate Trinity, but before Neo can talk to her, his therapist appears and immobilizes him by manipulating time. He reveals his identity as the Analyst, a program designed to study the human psyche. He explains that after Neo and Trinity's deaths, he was tasked with studying Neo's body and his anomalous powers as the One, convincing his superiors to resurrect both of them. He found that due to the One's inherent connection to all humanity in the Matrix, manipulating Neo could actually make the Matrix produce more energy. Moreover, he discovered that the code anomaly in Neo was actually shared in his bond with Trinity. By suppressing both their memories and keeping them close but always apart, the Matrix generated much more energy. Solving the energy crisis put the analyst in a position to seize power from the architect, after which he rebuilt the Matrix to control humans with emotional manipulation, citing that humans generally believe what they want to believe. However, Neo's liberation destabilized the system and triggered a, triggered a failsafe to reboot the Matrix. The analyst stalled the reboot by convincing his superiors that threatening to kill Trinity would get Neo to return voluntarily to his pod. Neo and Bugs return to Io and talk to Sati, an exile program he previously met. Seeking to avenge her parents' deaths at the hand of the machines, Sati helps devise a plan to free Trinity. Back in the Matrix, Neo makes a deal with the Analyst. He will return to his pod if he fails to convince Trinity to leave the Matrix. Tiffany reaffirms her identity as Trinity while talking with Neo. Realizing that he has lost, the Analyst attempts to kill her, but Smith appears and attacks the Analyst, seeking revenge for his own imprisonment. Neo, Trinity and the others escape in their vehicles but are chased through the streets by hordes of bot programs and attack helicopters. At the last as the last ones to be extracted, Neo and Trinity become cornered atop a skyscraper. Holding hands, they leap off and Trinity begins to fly, taking them to safety. With Trinity's newfound control over the Matrix, both return to confront the Analyst. They sarcastically thank him for giving them a second chance by resurrecting them, which they intend to use to remake the Matrix as they see fit. Neo and Trinity then triumphantly fly into the sky together. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and leave a comment down below telling me which movie you'd like to see me do next. Thank you for watching and goodbye.